Well, Channel 3 is your back to school authority, and this time of year is extra busy. But how busy is too busy? Well, I spoke with Dr. Laura Saunders with the Institute of Living at Hartford Healthcare about finding a balance between school and extracurricular activities. She says the word balance sets up an unrealistic expectation for most families. Instead, she recommends finding out what might be the motivation instead. It's the skills that they learn while they're doing that activity. It's the teamwork. It's the dedication to, you know, devoting time to build your skills. It's delay of gratification, right? You have to practice something over and over again before you get to go to a game or, or do something um, where you blend those skills. So it's the skills that our young people learn in those activities that's really important. So I would hate for those skills to get um, you know, demoted in some way because ki our kids get burnt out. She says the social aspect of extracurriculars is important for lifelong learning. And if your child commits to any kind of activity, it's also important to show them how to follow through, even if there's a little resistance. But it's also important for families to judge what's best for each child individually. I'm Caitlin Francis, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Scott, we'll send things back to you. All right, thank